Hey guys, it's Nat Tucker here from Make It Look Easy. How are you going? I've popped in to talk a little bit about print clashing and also how to tie a scarf because you keep asking me so I thought I would just show you, um, show it to you again. So here we go. So you can see I've got my tank on which um, a beautiful striped tank which looks fantastic back with a beautiful curly kind of creative print and the colors in common being blue so i'm just going to take my scarf off for a second and show you another print clash which is actually when you're wearing a necklace with a color in common as well or as close to as possible so it might not be exactly the color in common but absolutely looks like it belongs together as a print clash. So there's that print clash, and I'm going to show you again. We're going to put the scarf on, I'm going to tie it and show you how to do that, and you can see that print clash. Now another great tip as well, guys, if you are going somewhere to eat and you know you're going to get hot or you don't want to spill food in your scarf, it's a fabulous idea to wear a necklace underneath your scarf. So if you wear a ribcage necklace, um, you'll find that the easiest. So then you won't have too much going on up here while you're wearing your scarf. And so then when you sit down, you just beautifully and casually remove your scarf, pop it on your handbag, and there you are with a wonderful, a beautiful display still happening on your chest. So, all right, so here we go. So we're gonna look at this scarf. Now this scarf, I actually bought this in France, which was um, beautiful. And you can see it's like this, and it's actually a rectangle. It's a rectangle, so there we go, like that. Now, what we do with this is we actually grab the corner. So there's the corner there, and we pop it around our neck, and we pop the tail just below, just before our belly. So under our boob and below our belly. And then we grab this side here, and without twisting it, we bring it around our neck again to the other side da, 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 and then straighten them up so this guy is going to come down a little bit more like you can see there now what i like to do is cement the tail underneath so i like to bring the top over the top and cement both tails underneath here just puts a little bit of weight on there. Now you'll see that I've tied this now with the stripes showing a bit more. So when you saw me at the beginning, I had more of the creative print showing. So this time is that. So you can choose what you are wanting to display more of. So there's that. And I'm just gonna do it again so you can watch that again. But there you go, so there's the tail. Gives it a bit of weight as well. Now if it was really windy, so if I'm walking across the road in Melbourne um, and the wind comes up, um, another thing you can do is actually pop a brooch on one of your tails just to put, and I'd actually do both, to put some weight, some more weight on that. So the only thing that's going to blow is actually this here and the whole lot's not going to go woohoo up like that. <laughs> okay, so I'm just going to tie that for you again so that you can have another look. So here I am with my ribcage necklace on and we're going to grab our scarf again. This time I'm going to get to the creative corner. Pop it down just below the boob. Flouse it out. There we go. And pop it around. It's more creative there. And like I said, I'm going to put the tail underneath. There we go. And grab the tail on the other side. And play. Play and flouse. Play and flouse. I'll just step forward a little bit before playing with that. Get my creative all over the top. And the tails underneath the bottom. So there you go. So you can work out which part of the pattern you want to show off the most. We can also put that more over there as well. Have our tails down here. There's our tails. And here we go. And I'll just step back a little bit more. And there we go. So that's tying the scarf while we've got an amazing print clash happening. So now I want you guys to give it a go. All right, go do that for me. So grab a print top in your wardrobe, 
Grab a scarf that has a color in common or the same print. So striped tank, striped scarf, or a color in common. Give it a go and let me go, let me know how you go. All right, guys, see you next time. Bye. Hey guys, if you are really enjoying these videos, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel so that you never miss a thing.